I will explain to you what Katy Perry and Juicy J wants to tell you with their music video Dark Horse. This music video has a deep meaning in spirituality. First of all you will need to know that Dark Horse is not a dark colored horse. It is according to a dictionary, a person who keeps their interests and ideas secret, especially someone who has a surprising ability or skill. An example is, Anne is such a dark horse, I had no idea she would publish the novel. I will remind you of the music video trailer which gave us a short summary of the story, saying that, according to legend there was a magical queen in Memphis, Egypt. Every Eclipse Kings would travel from Brooklyn to Babylon to win her heart. If she fell in love you would be top dog. If she did not, her wrath would leave you whimpering. Her name was Katie Petra. Who will win her heart? This part actually tells us the whole meaning if you read it very carefully. Notice that Brooklyn means water and Babylon is a corrupted city, a city devoted to materialism and sensual pleasure. So it means that kings would do anything from water to fire to gain this thing she is talking about. But what is it? Before continuing the explanation you will need to know about the human brain. The brain consists of two hemispheres. They are called right hemisphere and left hemisphere of the brain. The right side is associated with one's creativity while the left side is related with one's analytical ability. In a spiritual concept, these will be called masculine and feminine energy. When you get a balance between two of these, you will be extremely powerful. And will live in harmony and peace. You must be wondering how this is connected to this music video. I will break it down for you now. Just think that the story in this music video is representing a human mind. The kings are being very creative to catch the queen's heart. The kings are therefore the right brain or the feminine energy. The queen is goal-oriented and is very strict with what she wants in order to gain a higher position. Think about the queen as the left brain or the masculine energy. So what they mean by the king and Cleopatra fallen in love is that the right and the left brain are in connection, thus the person will live in harmony. And that is what she says by, mark my words, this love will make you levitate, like a bird like a bird without a cage. There are different religions in this world, so the effectivity of the religion itself to gain spirituality varies from person to person. So we cannot really say that any religion is superior to the other. The different kings in this video brings with them different religions and belief systems. Only the right belief system for that individual owning this mindset could give a rise in spirituality. The person that holds this mind is revealed in the end of this video. It is a blonde girl that got freedom which got symbolized by the wings. This is where the reunion of the masculine and the feminine energies is revealed. Both parts are bowing each other. And if you look carefully at the top of this picture you will see a male and a female. If it is not clear enough, have a look at this picture from the music video trailer. They have used the symbols for male and female instead. Different characters come with different belief systems. And she is neglecting everyone except the last one. But notice that she keeps everything valuable from the failed kings. This means she kept everything good coming out of the religions even though it did not help to reform her. The rap by Juicy J tells us the situation about him transforming from female energy to male energy. And that is why he is warning you to not play around and get addicted to the stubborn male energy because it will eventually make you an unpleasant and cruel person. Here you see some Egyptian gods and Katy Perry in silver. And then there is this big snake crawling around her with its head on Katy's head. The Egyptian demigods and Katy is same colored because they are now in same level of consciousness. The snake is representing the serpent of light. It is called a kundalini activation, which pretty much is the energy of the body is united and moves through the spine up to the mind. I admit the wickedness of this video could mislead the interpretation. I sense they intentionally wanted to sound more treacherous than what it is. But the hidden message is revealed in a very creative way. If you have anything in your mind please let me know by a comment. And do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you are interested to follow up on my work. Thank you.